Hello, in this tutorial I'm going to show you uh, how to make terracotta pots. Uh, we press delete X to delete this one. Press 7 on the keyboard to go to that mode. We go to mesh circle and we put the vertices to 40. We press S to enlarge it a little bit. And we go to edit mode or we press tab to go to edit mode, it's the same. Press ES to go inside and we leave a little hole for the water. Now we're selecting the edges, it's underneath here. Right click on that one, Alt, right click on that one. E, Z to go up, something like that, left mouse click. S, pressing S to go up, open, like that. E, Z to go up a little bit, E, S to go outside, like that, and E, Z to come up, and S, oh sorry, E, Z to come up, left mouse click, S to come a little more open. And this one is done. What we're going to do now is we going to tools, at modifier and we use this button solidify why we want to put the material in so we want to give it a certain thickness to give it a certain thickness you you move it sideways like this for instance that but I want the material on the inside and that we can do from switching over here from minus one to plus one or the way around okay uh, we're going to add some material and we call it the um, mistaken and we choose here hex codes E77872 to have that uh, you can play around with it you can also put texture on it I'm keeping it very simple for the moment so we put sorry still in edit mode object mode we put this one aside like this and we're going to shrink it a little bit okay we're going to make the other pot one way add add mesh circle go back to edit mode press es to close left mouse click alt m sorry alt m at center selecting tool edges right click on that one alt right click and uh, we set we start with e z to go up somewhere over there s to go out a little conically and we scroll a little bit out so we can see what's happening and now we press EZ to go up, not much, not too much, and S to go out. EZ to come up, S to go inside. Oh, well, okay, we'll be going all, a little bit. EZ to go up, S to go inside. Is it EZ to come up, not much, left mouse click. S to come inside, EZ to come up, S to go inside, and bit by bit, sorry, bit by bit we're making it more and more conically, EZ to go up, S to go inside, EZ to go up, left mouse click, S to go inside, I think we'll leave it at that. E, Z to go up, not that much here, okay, and now we press S a little conically, and now we press E, S to go over the edge, and E, Z to go up, not much, but uh, this is also done too. Now we're going to uh, the same as on the other one, giving a thickness, we press that button, add, solidify, and we're going to put some material on 
like this okay good switch to object mode and press apply and we have done two of them um, show you another way to do is we're going to add mesh uh, where are you sphere the sphere the vertices okay we put it aside we put the, the, that one next to the other one I'm going to shrink this a little bit and we're going to give them also the material okay it's not important directly to see okay we're going to show to this one right click on that one edit we place them practically in the front so we can select very good okay cube 3 S to make it get a little larger. That's a bit too much. Okay. We're going to edit mode. We're going to use the B button. But before we use the B button, we switch here from visible parts to invisible parts also. This is the selection tool where we can uh, select both. And we select vertices. Right click on someone. Press B to select and we choose that and now we're going to say delete all uh, plates all faces right and the same on the top uh, the one that we want to delete we are pressing B over there and we want to delete these delete faces so what we have now is some sort of this one and we're going to start from top and we come to the same okay same principle choose edges right click on that one alt right click if we go up it's easy it's ez to go up like this es to go out so always the same commands ez to come up and the top is done now we go all the way around the other side the other side and we press uh sorry we select the edge alt not the correct one ah, i'll switch off probably is better the selection tool is made here now for visible and invisible parts that's the reason why we are selected that one over there if you want to deselect press the shift button right click and it is deselected but it's better to switch that again on so you can select directly the correct one okay alt next to ez to let it go yeah it should be something like this s to go inside and now scroll out because we want to make it now larger ez to go up like this and s and now it's a little, a little tricky yeah you have to get the same angle approximately okay and the only thing left is pressing f and it's closed and you got the same ball like the other one approximately uh, you can by s angle it a little bit more or less it's like you want okay to go back to the mode switch to q to object mode and we press s to rescale it and we put it next to the other ones so in a few seconds you have a okay, let's say a basic principle of how you can make something uh, going to add the same material and we're going to put them side by side i don't know if you will see them all but okay we put some uh, lights on And the lights, where is the lights? Okay, let me put in three. Going to copy as copy as shift D and position it somewhere else. 
Okay. Uh, camera view. Right click on that one. Switch to normal and scroll a little bit outside. If you want to see what the camera sees, you're pressing zero from your memory keyboard and sorry, there you have, you want to render it, press render and these are the pots I shown you. It's a pretty simple basic principle but it's uh, the reason to show you how you can make some pots very rapidly uh, and you give you an idea how to construct all the things also. Thank you for watching, if you like please like my channel, thank you.